We're very clear about the ethos at Priory. Um, it's encapsulated for us in the phrase, students first. We hope to really um, adapt the curriculum so it's, it best suits the needs, the capabilities, the abilities of our students. I think it's hugely important for the students to be involved in clubs after school. It allows them to have a voice, have a say in what they do. It allows them to let off a bit of steam after school and it allows them to engage with other students, other staff members who they may not engage with during the school day. The success of learning at Priory is very much based on positive relationships. So teachers model the behaviour that they want to see from students and lessons include high levels of reward, high levels of praise. Transition can be daunting for both the parent and the child and we try and make every opportunity for the parent to come in and speak to us. They're aware that there's a huge team in transition that are involved so they can speak to myself or the tutors. We've particularly chosen small tutor groups of 20 as opposed to traditional 30. Each tutor group has two tutors so there's lots and lots of points of contact for the parents. Students can access exactly what they want, they can succeed at their own level, whether that's as a level one learner, a level two or an extended gifted and talented learner. The virtual learning environment of VLE is available for students and also for parents to go on and have a look and see what the students are actually doing in class. It's widely used across the school, across the curriculum and it does give a great opportunity for parents to see what lessons they've actually done that day. It also gives them an opportunity to see what home learning they've been set, so parents can help out their students with that. So it's high on our priority list to make sure that every student leaves with outstanding exam results. It's also high on our list of priorities to make sure students have a full access to extracurricular activities, including school trips, school sports, school music and the arts. Um, it's not uh, a school, it's more of a, a community of learning. One outstanding feature of Priory Community School are our learning leaders. These are the people who oversee the growth and development of a group of students from when they enter the school to when they leave in Year 11. The advantage of our learning leaders is the fact that they are actually non-teachers. This enables them to be out and about across the school during the day, tracking the progress of their students, recognising success, praising achievement and supporting those students who need additional advice and guidance. They have working with them a team of personal tutors. This ensures that there's a huge wealth of experience in each tutor team. We are very keen to make sure everybody meets, reaches their potential. We've had record exam results in 2008 and 2009 and our predictions in 2010 are for 80% of the students to get five good GCSE grades or equivalent A to C and English and Maths, that's going to be around about 65%. The PCS we have a five part lesson. The idea of that is to ensure that there's quality learning going on across the whole school. Uh, the five part lesson is called Learn. The L is for Link and that's the part of the lesson where you explore the context of the lesson and link it to the students prior learning. The next part of the lesson is called Establish and that's the part of the lesson that's uh, exploring with the students what they're going to be learning today. The middle part of the lesson is Achieve and that's where the students are actually working on a learning task. And then the all important bit, the R, is for Review and in that part of the lesson we'll review whether they've met their learning objectives and we'll review, um, they'll review their own work and they'll also review the work of other learners and give them feedback. And then the final part of the lesson is Next Steps and that's about looking to the future and how the students will then build on the learning that's taken place. Being a technology college enables us to get extra funding from the government which enables our learners in design technology, maths, science and ICT to have extra equipment, hardware, software and that sort of thing. 
And so when they come into school, the students feel like it's a technology college. There's lots and lots of things going on. We've got lots of links with industry. Students go out on visits. We do a whole range of diplomas, BTEC engineering, a whole range of other qualifications that um, suit the needs of our learners. The trust partners are extremely important to the school. We look at them as essential to furthering the aims and aspirations of our students. Um, where the trust partners bring in something totally different. Well, after the lower school curriculum, year seven and eight, um, our students um, enter the GCSE or the BTEC route. Now, within the GCSE route, students will either study the three separate sciences on a modular basis, um, or students can leave prior with the two GCSEs, which is a core and an additional. So it will be considered a double science. The pass rate for science um, has risen significantly over the past three to four years. Um, this year we're expecting a significant increase again in the pass rates of our students. We're looking at a 95% pass rate for BTEC students and a 90% success rate with our GCSE students. The ICT and technology is central to everything we do at Priory. We're in a fantastic position where we can offer students two hours a week in year seven, eight and nine of ICT, which is, which is a really unique opportunity for students. We also have amazing facilities here at Priory. We have um, the, all the Apple Mac suites, we have ICT computers right across the school and the way we teach ICT does really set them up for how they're going to use ICT in the rest of their lives. We collect data in four times a year on the students. We collect in a currently working at level or grade and also a predicted level or grade for the end of the course. We then use that data and analyse it to be able to identify students who are doing really well against their targets but also those who aren't doing quite so well against their targets and they may need some support in some of their subjects. For us it's very important that everything we do is geared to the success and the happiness and ultimately the life chances of the students. finish here at Priory at 5 to 3 which enables us to put on a full programme of extracurricular activities which we, we term period 6. Sport is absolutely wonderful at Priory, fantastic playing fields, magnificent teaching in sport and in PE. We've got fantastic facilities here at Priory School, um, which means we can do a lots of different sports and lots of different activities. We can offer things on the AstroTurf, so we can offer lots of traditional sports like hockey, netball, football, tennis, but we also like to expand and like, like to do lots of different activities, so we try things like lacrosse. Facilities at Priory are really good. We've got like the indoor sports hall and the gym, the netball courts, the astro, the red grass and the big playing field. School play is a very important part of our school year. Our music festivals, our concerts in the summer and in the winter and extracurricular activities of all kinds, robotics, Homework club is on every evening, people can come into the library and have support after school. And I think I'm right in saying that uh, last school year we had about 70 different activities on during uh, the school week. Here at Priory we have absolutely loads, like there's the scratch club going on with IT, you have the hockey, the netball, the rugby, you have the music clubs, you have the orchestra, art clubs. We have free running going at the moment, we have horse riding going at the moment and obviously our plan throughout the year is to extend that a lot further. Transition in Priory has grown, it's a huge project now that doesn't just start in the month of June when the students start to come up to look at the school. 
We actually begin our transition planning in October and we have an open evening and a priory breakfast to invite parents in and new students who may be coming up to have a look at the school. The idea of the priory breakfast, the family breakfast, is so that we can showcase the school and the students can experience everything about priory in a very non-formal, um, enjoyable way. And it's also very much, let's get the parents involved right from day one. Yeah, I, I was nervous. It was very nerve-wracking because when you joined in, you didn't really know anyone. But when I got here, all the teachers helped me settle down. I was very nervous because I didn't have any friends from the previous school come into Priory, but I soon found new friends, so that was good. We invite the students in on several occasions to do workshops, participate in our curriculum, um, so they are much more confident when they come up. And this year, one of our big activities was a spray art project, which decorated the underpass, which means when students come to school, it's a much nicer environment. We spend a vast amount of time at Priory asking students what they want us to know about them. So for example this year when they came up they really want us to understand what they're proud of and what they want us to aspire to be and these are very key questions and it was very important as we develop our holistic approach to the students learning and where they want to get to ultimately. Priory is fun, friends and history. Priory is community. Priory is art, drama and music. Priory is good at sports. Priory is lunch. Priory is fun. Priory is really cool. I like Priory because there's a lot of cool friends. I like Priory because the teachers are nice. I enjoy the English lessons. Drama, PE and the technology and science. I like drama in Priory school. It's great and fun. The teachers. That's what I like about Priory. Priory is fun. Priory is the best. Priory is our future. The creative art. The excellent IT equipment it has. The technology. Art. I love the PE faculties. I like the cooking lessons because they're fun. All the teachers are really nice and like helpful. Yeah. Priory is drama. Priory is art. Priory is music. Priory is technology. Priory is the future.